Could there be life in interstellar space? The vast dark void between the stars, known as interstellar space, has long been imagined as a lifeless, frozen expanse. Devoid of planets, bathed in cosmic radiation and holding temperatures just above absolute zero, it hardly seems a place where life could persist. Yet the possibility that life might exist, or at least survive, in interstellar space remains an intriguing and active area of scientific speculation. One of the more studied ideas supporting this notion comes from the panspermia hypothesis. This theory suggests that life, or the building blocks of it, can travel across the cosmos via natural space vehicles like meteorites, comets, or interstellar dust. These cosmic wanderers may carry hardy microbial life ejected from planetary surfaces by impacts or volcanic activity. If shielded within rock or ice, such organisms might endure the vacuum, radiation, and extreme cold of space for millions of years. Supporting this, scientists have discovered microbes on Earth, such as Deinococcus radiodurans, that can survive extreme doses of radiation and vacuum conditions. In lab settings, some bacteria have even withstood simulated interstellar environments, protected inside rocks or encased in thin films of water ice. Moreover, organic molecules such as amino acids and polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons have been identified in interstellar clouds, suggesting that complex chemistry and perhaps prebiotic conditions can develop even in the deepest reaches of space. Still, life in interstellar space would face formidable challenges. The density of particles is so low, just a few atoms per cubic centimeter, that energy and nutrients would be nearly impossible to come by. Moreover, cosmic rays and ultraviolet radiation from distant stars continuously bombard the environment. Under such conditions, active metabolism or replication seems unlikely. Life here, if it exists, would likely be in a dormant state, simply surviving the journey between stars rather than thriving. Despite the speculative nature of these ideas, they are taken seriously enough to warrant study. Astrobiologists and planetary scientists examine meteorites for potential biosignatures and simulate interstellar conditions to test the survivability of microbes. Future missions may even collect samples from comets or interstellar objects like the mysterious Oumuamua to further investigate these possibilities. In the end, while the existence of life in interstellar space remains unproven, it represents a frontier of astrobiology where science, imagination, and the cosmic unknown converge. The more we explore, the more we realize that life, if it exists elsewhere, might be far more tenacious than we ever imagined.